This is Antoinette Nikki Styles. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Antoinette Nikki Styles. And in this video, I am going to be showing you how I achieved this look. I guess you can kind of call it like rope twist on both sides. And I pinned it to the back and I just defined my curls and pulled out some little side pieces. If you like this look and you want to know how I achieved it, keep watching this video okay i'm gonna start by my hair is already detangled a little bit damp at the back but i'm gonna spray it a little bit before i add my products my two products i'm going to use today is the as i am long and lux the pomegranate and passion fruit curl enhancing smoothie it's pink on the inside smells really good and then i'm gonna use the Grow Yogurt Leave-In Conditioner. This is the same line. My sister actually gave me this, so I'm trying it out. And I don't know what happened to my oil. It's Jamaican Black Castor Oil Coconut. I'm going to put that on first and then apply the leave-in conditioner and then the curl enhancing cream. I'm not going to use a gel because... I just don't want to. Plus, I don't have, I feel like if I was gonna use a gel, I would rather use a gel that went with the line that I'm using now. My daughter's in here with me. She just has to be my little tag along. Okay, I sprayed a little bit and I put my oil. This is going to be like a half up, half down style. I'm going to go in with the leave-in conditioner. Now with the curl enhancing cream, I feel like I need to split this in two sections. gonna finish up on this side and then work my way up to the top to do my braids and finish the style all right I have completed the back and I had to step away for a bit so it actually air dried some but I'm gonna go ahead and go in in the front with just the lead-in conditioner I'm not gonna use the curl enhancing cream because I don't well the smoothie I'm sorry because I don't want it to make it so hard for me to um twist my hair i think i said braid in the beginning but i think i'm gonna go with the twist and i'm gonna make sure it's detangled this is how i used to do my hair a lot i i haven't decided if i'm going to do just a braid straight back or i mean i'm sorry twist straight back or um like make a little not bun. Oops. So I'm just gonna go in, really braiding my hair if it's not like soaking wet. Soaking wet is just, it seems to be harder for me. trying to see if I wanted to just leave this hanging but I don't really like it that way I think if I would have made a braid it may would be it may would have looked a little bit better 
and maybe even put a bead on the end. But who knows? We'll see. I'm gonna finish this one up. So I'm going to see about doing it this way, taking my two twists. If you don't have any bobby pins or you don't like to use those, you can take it and make it a ponytail at the back so that this comes down and goes into it and it just sits out like this. However, I normally take it like this and I do like a rope around the back and I think that's how I'm going to keep it and I take my bobby pin and I pin it down I don't have a closed one by me so I'm going to use this open one and then I take this side and I make sure I twist it the same way I started out twisting it and then I'm going to tuck it under here and pin it down as well together it'll work much easier if you have the closed bobby pins fyi and i'm just kind of tucking it to where my ends are hidden and you can do oh my god i think i was in the frame too well i'm sorry about that but you can do whatever makes you comfortable and however you have to fix it for your hair because it may not take as much as what I did, but my hair is a little bit longer. So I had to um, wrap it around and pin it a little bit more. I'm gonna spray a little bit more water on this. Oh, wasn't trying to spray my face, but yeah. This, this is it. You know, I'm gonna turn around for you. I'm swap down some. I may add a little bit of oil in my hand and rub it on my hair. It feels a little bit crunchy. I'm not sure why. I guess the curl smoothie. But I do like how the um the long and luxe curl smoothie has kind of given me a good curl pattern going. It's defined my curls pretty good over here. Right here is always my side that doesn't curl as much, so I'm not mad at it. I do like that. This is the final look. Yeah, yeah, make sure you take it all the way, guys. Take it all the way. This is it. Thank you so much for following me this long if you follow me to the end of my video. Again, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.